Hello everyone, in this uh, video I will show you how to allow access to Windows Virtual Desktops only from certain locations. So you have a use case wherein you want Windows Virtual Desktop access to be allowed only from one particular office or maybe from your office locations. First of all, in order to do that, you need to find out the public IP address used on the router of your office from which all the requests goes to the internet because Windows Virtual Desktop is accessed over internet. So in my home, I have this uh, Windows 10 machine which gets a private IP address, but on the router, there is a public IP address which all my systems connected use that. So I will have to find that out. In your company, you can get that from your network guy. So this is the public IP address for all the machines which go out from my internet use. So I will copy this and create a, under conditional access in AD, I will create a named location for that. So I will define a new location under IP ranges. I will specify the IP address and mark it as a trusted locations. You could also specify a range of IP addresses so this one is saved here and I will go to policies, go to new policy. So allow access to WVD. Under users and groups, I will select all users. Under cloud apps, I will select Windows Virtual Desktop. So Windows Virtual Desktop and client and click on select. Under conditions, I will go to location, configure it, yes. And I will select include all locations, but exclude my selected location, which is my home uh, IP. I will also select MFA trusted IP. And under grant, I will block access. So now any of the user trying to access Windows Virtual Desktop from any location, from any location will be blocked but it will exclude my trusted location so now if I try to open that uh, Windows virtual desktop it should work I will enable the policy so it should work now let us test it So I am able to log into my Windows Virtual Desktop. So it works now, but uh, what if I go to some other location and try to access it and my public IP address gets changed. So let me change my public IP address and then test it again. I have connected to a different network. So let me see if my public IP address changes. So now my public IP address has changed and let us try to access Windows Virtual Desktop and uh, it should fail this time. So yes, it is uh, failing now and I'm getting a message that I cannot access this right now. So now we have seen how we can allow access to Windows Virtual Desktop from only certain locations using conditional access. So with conditional access, uh, we saw an example wherein on we blocked the access from all the locations, but you could also have conditions wherein you can allow access with the MFA or only allow access from compliant machines. So I hope you liked this uh, small video and Please like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.